Well, I'm at the Kmart store in Crystal Lake. I don't know if you guys remembered, but a few videos back, I made a video about missing World Turtle Day. Well, guess what? The turtle came back to haunt me. I just took about a 40 pound stone turtle back for a turn at Kmart because it unexpectedly showed up at my doorstep. Yeah, isn't that odd? Two foot stone turtle showing up at your doorstep. Well, I can't say it was totally unexpected. It was just unexpected that it showed up at my doorstep. While well, I was at BC's place, I noticed his lovely wife was fond of turtles and was looking for a turtle statue to go in her garden. And so I've been looking around since I got back to try to find a nice looking turtle. And the ones that I found that were plastic or different resins were kind of stupid looking. I didn't really want to give that as a gift to somebody since it was so dumb looking. And so I go online Kmart and I find this large stone turtle that was really nice looking. It was uh, shaped very well, looked like a real turtle, and it was uh, not a lot of colors added to it, so in case she, if she wanted to decorate it herself, later on add some colors to it. So I liked it and I went ahead and went online. And I don't know about you guys, but if it has to do with online and it's either Kmart or Sears, it never works out good. It just never does. I, the Sears store near me is okay, and the uh, Kmart store that I'm coming from here is a very good Kmart store. I really like it as far as their brick and mortar stores are really great, but they just cannot do stuff online. I mean, they've fouled up so many times with me. It's like I'm, I'm almost giving up. I'm just, I'll deal with the brick and mortar stores. I'm not doing anything online. But anyway, back to this. Turtle. I filled out the form, um, clicked a different shipping address, and filled it out. I mean, uh, they could claim that I forgot and did it wrong, but when I do something that involved, I know I did it right. Clicked on it, shipped to a different address, filled out all the address, to make sure it got to BC's place. And then what happens? Three days later, the turtle shows up on my doorstep from UPS. So first, I'm pissed at UPS. I think they screwed up. So I call up UPS, and they said, no, that was the shipping address Kmart gave us. So I get on the horn to Kmart, which actually is Sears customer service, I guess, you know, since they're all the same place, I'm speaking with Sears customer service reps. First guy, no help at all. No help at all. It's like, no, you did it wrong. It's your fault. Blah, blah, blah. We can't do anything for you. Goodbye. And I said, just give me a number where I can call somebody. Speak to a manager. So he gave me an 800 number. And I get another rep. This one starts to help me out about halfway through talking to them, I get a, uh, they, it interrupts the call with a recorded voice to take a survey and just totally disconnects me in the middle of the call before I could even get this completed. I mean, we hadn't even gotten to a, a total explanation of what was wrong and how to solve it. So I call back a third time and finally get a hold of somebody that can help me. And what they said was, uh, let's do it this way. Let's just send your friend another one. So right there online, they took the information, they uh, got a turtle sent out, like I think it was actually shipped within an hour of when I got the off the phone from them. So at least they were doing their job pretty good. And the turtle, another turtle was on its way. And then they said, well, um, instead of a shipping label, how about if you got a Kmart, you can just run it up and give them a copy of this email that we're gonna send you and take it up to the Kmart store and they'll take it back for you which actually did work out really nice. I mean, I went to the Kmart store, went to customer service. The, the girl herself uh, needed some help from uh, calling up a manager to see about if she could refund the total charges, including shipping, and the manager at the Kmart store said, oh yeah, absolutely, give him all of his money back. So, uh, because of the brick and mortar store's help, I uh, ended up being a happy customer out of all of it. But yeah, the turtle definitely got back at me. Just remember guys, if you don't want the revenge of the turtle, next year when it comes around, celebrate World Turtle Day. 
fear the turtle.